When you're out there running and gunning, sometimes you just need things fast. And this little vlogger multi-tool can get it done really quick. Let's take a look and see if this little sucker right here is something you might want to have on you next time you're on set. We've all been there on a set running and gunning and inevitably stuff comes loose over the course of a day. I mean, you have a tripod plate that becomes loose. Maybe something on your gimbal starts to wiggle. Maybe there's just, you always have those little things that come and get loose and go throughout the day which is just part of the normal wear and tear of being on a film set. Now, if you're like me, I used to walk around with these, basically a bunch of hex keys on me, and I have them in almost every Pelican case I have, and in the middle of the day, if I was running around and something got loose, I would have to run back to my Pelican case or get my AC to do it, and we'd have to bring these hex screws out and fix it. And it's one of those things that just was distracting and a little annoying. Um, and that's why if you're on a set, you wanna have access to tools that allow you to just make those quick adjustments, those quick tightenings, and not distract you from getting the shot that you need. Now, recently Andy Cine contacted me and asked me if I would be interested in taking a look at their Andy Cine Vlogger Multi-Tool. Now, full disclosure, I am not being paid by Andy Cine to do this. I am not sponsored by them in any way, shape, or form. As a matter of fact, they sent me this and just said, hey, can you just give us an honest review of it? So I took it, and honestly, I'm always on set and eating things that can help me work my day a little faster. So I said, yeah, let's take a look at it. Why not? <laughs> so basically, there's not much to it, but it's a very simple, but they actually did some really kind of ingenious things here. So let's take a look at what this thing is and if it's something that you think you might need to help you on a set. Now, if you look here, this is the Andy Sinnery 8 Multi-Tool Vlogger that they have. Now, one thing to know is this thing is made for camera operators and vloggers in mind. You can see that just in the tool set out now. Okay, so now if we take a look here, you can see the eight multi-tools that consist of this piece. Now, the first thing here is this. It has a giant flathead screwdriver. And this is really, really great because if you look here, this is a typical kind of plate you have for a tripod. And what's great is this sucker fits in there so well. It takes up the whole amount of space. And one thing that I run into that I get frustrated a lot with, especially with normal flathead screwdrivers if you're running around the set, is they're actually a little too thin for these wider quarter inch or three eight screws that you actually have a lot of times on the bottom of your tripod plates. Whereas this is a perfect big size. It fits really nice, really, really good. Okay, so what you have here then is a basic standard Phillips head screwdriver, not much to it. And then essentially you start getting into the hex keys of the thing. Now it starts off on this side, you have a 3 16 hex head, which is nice for some of your bigger things. And then if I switch it over here, you'll see we have got a whole range of different hex heads. And essentially starts off, you have a one millimeter, a two millimeter, a 2.5 millimeter, a three millimeter, and a four millimeter hex head. So as you can see, based on this, you actually have a really good range of hex heads that you can fit right in your pocket. Now, one thing about this, is as I hold this up and look at it, is I love the size. Look at this thing. This thing is absolutely just really tiny. It's about the size of a cigarette lighter. It's really, really small. It's about two and a half inches long and just over an inch wide um, this way. So it's a really, really convenient, super small package. You can slip it in pockets really easy. Um, it also comes with a keychain. Uh, you can actually click it on your keychains if you want, just have it with you that way. Or you could take a rope and click a rope on it and click it on a, if you have a hook or anything else like that, you could put that on there as well. So really, really convenient. The size is fantastic. Okay, so the tools are great, but let's be honest, you can get a flathead and, and Phillips head and these kind of hex screws in other things. What I think is really cool, and this is one of those things that I was really kind of impressed with, was kind of the creativity they did on the exterior side of this little multi-tool. And if you look here, if you look here, there are just lots of different mounting options here on the actual multi-tool itself. And it actually starts off, you can have a quarter inch 20 screw thread. You actually have RE locating holes, a 3 8 16 screw head, 
And down here you have an M2.5 screw head. Now what's great about these little thread holes is that it gives this thing a lot more versatility and makes it that much more useful for you on set. One example of that is I have a 3.8 screw here that I use frequently for tripod plates when I'm out there shooting. And sometimes, maybe if you're running between gimbals and you wanna go from three eighths to quarters, or maybe you're one of those people that has a tendency to lose little screws like this because they're easy to lose on a set. What's great about this is you can take this and actually screw it right here on your multi-tool. Boom, and now it's attached to your multi-tool. It's not going anywhere. And you don't have to worry about losing these little screws throughout the day. You can put quarter inches over here, over here, depending on your screws. So you may see walk around with extra screws in case you're worried about losing something, or maybe they're just a tool you need later on that might need one. You know you can have it right here and you're not digging through pockets trying to find it. I found that really, really cool. Okay, and not only do these mounting tools work as great places to store screws, they actually serve, <laughs> Believe it or not, another cool little function. You can actually use this to mount stuff around on your camera if you're in an emergency situation. And let me show you how this works. I have a magic arm here on my camera and you can use this to connect to your magic arms and actually form a handle. So check this out. And boom, check that out. If you're ever in a situation I have, look at this. It's an emergency little two-handed handle I can use on a magic arm. Um, you know, it's just nice to have that. It's really random, but maybe you just wanna get that extra stability. You have that, it's right there. And it's on there pretty sturdy, really based on your magic arm. So it's a really cool little feature of it. I think it's really well thought out. And really my final verdict on this is, you know, if you do not have a multi-tool, you need to get one on set. And this one, one of the great things about this one, this one is really affordable. This is only $29.99 right now. And you know, for that amount of money and the amount of things you have to use, I literally used this right before I started this channel today because I had a tripod leg that was loose. And it was so nice just being able to pull it out of my pocket, tighten that tripod leg and come here and start shooting. So would I recommend this? Yeah, I mean, it's a pretty good sturdy multi-tool and it's got the things that you need. It's got a big, big flat head screw for the screws underneath your tripod plates and the hex screws are so useful and so handy. And it's so much easier than walking around with something like this and having to take these things out and lose them and all that stuff. This is so nice, I can slip in my pocket when I'm done and I'm good to go. Anyway guys, I hope that helps. I would love to hear what you think about this. Yeah, go out there and keep on shooting. Yeah, and I'll talk to you soon.